we're going to talk a little bit about it. We took it on a good ride. We tested the brakes. This bike has to be very safe, very ultra safe. So when I say I listen to my viewers, I do 100%. Uh, Little Evil pointed out about the uh, coaster brakes. And he's correct. Uh, I had to convert this thing into a freewheel. Now, Elliot Hover did a beautiful video, moved very articulate on everything, on how to tighten the bearings and everything. Unfortunately, uh, <laughs> the only people I could find that convert coaster brakes to a free coaster are mostly kids that were doing them on their bikes. So I had limited information on that. I got it though, and, uh, and it works. Uh, so it's a free coaster now it's not the hub adapter has not moved so that's good but this bike has to be ultra safe all the nuts and bolts were checked uh and like i said the video that la hover did on tightening the wheel bearings up and stuff like that very good video uh Yeah, I just put a simple uh, intake on it. It works fine. You see in the video, top speed was 36.5 miles an hour. Uh, LA Hover also mentioned that uh, secure the fenders. So I pulled them off, welded quarter 20 heavy washers to them and they're good to go, they're nice and ready. So I did do that. Uh, we found all kinds of, I found all kinds of stuff. The whole brake mechanism and everything on this thing and all the bearing, everything was loose. Because of the disc, I can't run the arm, so that's the reason I converted it to free coaster, which is, <laughs> <laughs> Somebody knows better than me about it. Post a good video on it, okay? The uh, these were loose. Everything was loose, and I don't understand it. Really, don't. Uh, the only thing that wasn't loose was the nuts on this. I had to. They rang off. They were all cross threaded, so I had to put a new gas tank on it. That's where you saw the gas tank hit the floor and exploded. So. <laughs> But uh, we had a good ride on it. Like I said, 36.5 miles an hour top speed with my my self on it. You get somebody uh, lighter, I'm sure it'll probably go faster. He came over here looking at it, and we're hoping to get a group ride up. He hasn't ridden it yet, and uh, I think he's still leery from the first time he rode it from the other guy. Because when I picked it up and I went to turn it. Uh, the back tire with the chains off, I couldn't move it because everything was loose and jammed up. This is something else too that I did because I wanted the brakes to be really positive. And you can see in the video, it stopped at 36, almost a, a very short distance. It did good. But the original one of these is plastic and you get a real mushy feel. Well, if you get this particular type right here, a nut for this will fit inside here. You tighten this up on it and you drill the hole out where normally the, uh, shoot, the cable would go and then snap this off and pop it in and you get a lot better feel with that right there, I'm telling you. And now these nuts, I'm going to have to, they won't stay tight on there but they don't fit on there good either. So, but anyway, I gotta get them on there again. But uh, they were over here, they were looking at it. Uh, Kendrick, he wrote it, he loved it. And uh, I just, the ride I just did, I, <laughs> I really like it too. It's a good riding bike. Uh, but that's it guys, and uh, enjoy the video. Uh, got some brake test on it, and uh, <laughs> and some other goofy stuff. So, y'all uh, hit like, subscribe, and y'all have a wonderful day.